Meghan Markle naive to expect to have free reign across firm can't have voice. Meghan Markle was branded naive for expecting she would have free reign and be able to pick what she would be able to work on in the royal family. Meghan Markle was outspoken about her support for female empowerment and education before she officially joined the royal family in 2018. Members of the firm do advocate for causes through their charity work but are traditionally not overly active on issues that could be considered political. Royal expert Amanda Platel branded the Duchess of Sussex naive for expecting she would be able to freely discuss her views and contravene centuries of royal protocol. Speaking to BBC's The Princes and the Press, the Daily Mail columnist claimed Meghan expected to have free reign on how she would handle her royal career. But she insisted royal family members are accustomed to not having as much voice as they would be were they supporting causes as private citizens. BBC host Amol Rajan said, In so many ways, Meghan is a welcome breath of fresh air but the last thing Britain needs is an overconfident, virtue-signaling American actress using her position in the royal family to promote her right in views. What did you mean when you said the issue was that she's overconfident and virtue-signaling? Ms. Platel said, I think that it shows the utmost naivete of any intelligent woman, which she is, to think that you join an organization like the royal family and have free reign and free speech. Relationship expert Neil Wilkie claimed earlier this month the Duchess of Sussex was too outspoken for the royal family and courtiers. Mr. Wilkie said, I think Meghan has moved from being a reasonable actress to suddenly part of the royal family, who don't really want her included because she's different and is too outspoken. So, she's been shunned by the royals, she's been shunned by the courtiers. Since stepping down from her working royal role, Meghan Markle has regained full control of her voice and began using it to lobby in favor of campaigns close to her heart. In October, it was revealed the Duchess had been cold calling U.S. senators in a bid win over support for equal paid parental leave across the United States. Speaking to the New York Times defended herself from criticism suggested she had been using her title to promote a political cause. She said, I don't see this as a political issue, frankly.